Thermostats are typically found in a hallway, family room, or living room. In many homes, these rooms are the most comfortable places in the house, but without a zone system, other parts in the home can be uncomfortable in the summer or winter months, such as lower level living spaces and bedrooms on a second floor. Using a T9 with wireless room sensors can help by sensing the temperature in the occupied rooms. You may want to prioritize the temperature to be set in the master bedroom at sleep. You can set priority for selected sensor as part of your setback schedule or when geofencing to prioritize one or more wireless sensors during different periods of the day. Select priority. All of the indoor sensors display. When we select guest bedroom and master bedroom, the thermostat will control to the average of these two selected rooms. Instead of using selected rooms, we may want to control to the average of the rooms where people are. We select active rooms for this. The person icon next to the temperature shows that this room is active, which is tracked from the motion sensor in the indoor sensors. You can modify the motion sensitivity by opening the sensor menu on the thermostat and going to options. You can disable the motion sensor if desired, or you can change the motion sensitivity level. For example, if you have big dogs, you may want to change the motion sensitivity to low so active rooms only trigger when a lot of motion is detected. Once you have modified your motion sensitivity, you will be able to control to active rooms priority. You can set priority for selected or active rooms in a schedule or geofencing. For more information, see the schedules and geofencing videos.